For the first time, children with special needs have competed at the Queensland Nipper Championships. It was also the 50th anniversary of the titles, which were first held at Burley Heads on the Gold Coast in 1969. A special day for the albatross nippers and the wider life-saving movement. Competing in the march past at the state titles for the first time, these special needs nippers didn't win and didn't care. So much fun. Being included was the goal. Very exciting for the kids to be part of it all. And it's also wonderful for the parents as well to see their, their kids having smiles on their faces, enjoying themselves. This is the first time a group like this has competed in Queensland, certainly out of state titles as well. The next goal is to roll out a special needs nipper program nationally. More than 1,600 junior lifesavers from Port Douglas in far north Queensland to the New South Wales border competed over three days. Burley Heads hosted the carnival. It's the same beach the first Nipper State titles were held on half a century ago. This carnival is all fun and games for the Nippers, but there is a serious side. It's teaching them the skills they'll need to one day patrol Queensland's beaches. Whether it be on the beaches or in classrooms or generally out in public, these kids do have the skills to, um, to perform those rescues, resuscitations, first aids. Last year, 60 people drowned in Queensland and almost 70% were male. Most died during the spring and summer months. Tom Forbes, ABC News, Gold Coast.